Greetings, person currently watching this, and welcome back to The Last Tinker City of Colors. So, in uh, while I was off camera, I went ahead and was breaking up everything in the place because I wanted to aggravate these people because I don't like them, and uh, this happened. That thing showed up, and then this stuff showed up, so uh, I'm just gonna go ahead and do, you know, finish what I started because that's the kind of person I am. Alright, so that looks like everything that is breakable. Yes. Alright. So we need to follow these red symbols because Tap made doubly sure that we knew that those symbols exist and that we should probably follow them. So, I mean, I'm going to continue breaking these boxes along the way until at least I get bored of doing it. I mean, if it gets boring, I'm going to stop doing it. But, you know, I, I'd just rather not promise to destroy everything to aggravate a person and then not do it. Because then it makes me a liar. The symbols, they're leading us to the Red Dome. That's, what do you have to say? The red gag is at the dome right now. Be careful. Okay, then I'll just punch him in the head ten more times than I normally do. Which is, like, uh, none. So I'll just punch him in the head ten. Oh, no, it's... Oh, no, it's these guys. I punch these guys, like, in the head, like, 20 times a day. What's Muggy Brain doing here? Boys, we can't let him into the red dome. Bolzo has enough problems as it is. Protect the switch. All right, fine. Beat y'all senseless. I don't remember much of how to do the controls in this game because it has been a while since I played it. Because there's been a lot uh, going on in my life. But fortunately, because of all this going on in my life, I should be in a situation where when I record is not dependent on whether or not my brother chooses to go to school that day. Man, you really pack a punch. You know that. Are you guys serious? Have you got nothing better to do right now than pick a fight with us? It's not that, man. A few of us were drained by that white stuff. The boss is looking for a way to fix them. And we'll help... Okay, hold on a second. Okay, cool. And we'll help him if that's what it takes. But people back at the square need help right now. So quit lazing around and get... Your scaly butts over there. Okay, fine. But if anything happens to the boss, we'll grind you to bits. Yeah, because you were so successful in doing it a second ago. Understand? Let's get going, Red Gang. Okay, so it's like uh, old school RPGs where if you hold down the uh, next button, it'll make the text scroll faster. Yeah, I used to do that a lot. Back when I played old school RPGs. You know, like Final Fantasy, uh, Breath of Fire... Legend of the Gaia, Jake Cocoon, stuff like that. Because at that time, you know, I was a kid, so it was pretty much just I was mashing the skip conversation button saying, blah, 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 when do I get to hit stuff? Because that's all I cared about doing. I mean, I still kind of am like that nowadays, but, you know, I, I like to think I'm a bit more literate than I was back when I was like six, eight, twelve, you know, that neighborhood. Oh my. So, uh, don't know if you noticed, dude, but place is kind of screwed. Oh, hey, it's that guy. And he looks happy to see me. All right. I think I'm going to end up stop breaking these boxes here soon because it's it's I think it's just going to take too much time if I break every single box in the red district. Then again, I don't want to be ah, screw it, let's go. Oh, high tap. The red dome. Whoever painted these symbols wanted us to come here. And look who's over there! Bozo and his gang! It looks like they're in bad shape. Do you think we should go and see what's wrong with them? They may be slime balls, but still. Let's see if we can get to them, okay? Alright, fine. I mean, if, if while I'm on the way to the red thing, you know, I happen to stop by them, cool, but I'm not gonna go. Hi there! Oh, no, you don't! Get out of here with that stuff. Ah! Ah, don't you dare! Get out of here with that. Freak. Whoa, these guys can shoot! Yeah. Thanks for the warning, Tap. Hey, you know when that warning might have been useful? Five minutes ago. Before they started shooting at me. Alright, so can I not fight them? Can I like, punch you through a fence? Oh, I think I can. Yeah! Ha <laughs> ha! Oh. He scooched back too far. Now I can't hit him anymore. Alright, fine, whatever. Moving on. Oh, this thing. Yeah, this thing. I still, okay, okay, now I suddenly, okay, it's a right bumper to jump. I forgot in the last episode how to do that. 
Yeah! Coming in hot, like always. Okay, so we're on the other side of the stuff. Right, so we need to go this way. Little jump things. Ah! Oh, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on. Everybody calm it down for a second. Yeesh. Alright, so we can't go that way because the stuff is that way. Okay. Well, it's nice to see you're still in existence, Mr. Octopus. Ah, ow! No, go, 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 go! Alright, and... Ah! No! Trixie! Ah! Who? Oh, oh, I almost died. I hate you, you know that? Like, I've met a lot of just jerky uh, squid things in my life, you know, like krakens and just giant sea octopuses. But you, 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 actually, no, you don't take the cake. I gotta say, he doesn't take the cake. No, he doesn't take the cake. Ah, well, I guess for a single octopus, yes, he wins. But the thing is, is I've been, you know, trolled by octopus harder than he ha oh you oh ooh, ooh. getting tricksy on me ah no ow gotta keep moving can't hit a movie target okay go 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 windows of opportunity gotta utilize them all right so once we get past all this oh ooh, ooh, oh okay so can we calm it down now great thanks okay so as i was gonna say i've been trolled worse than by those things over there trust me oh okay oh Why does he look like he just shut down? Like he was a... Ro <laughs> is it just me or does he look more like a robot that just shut down? Like, you know, his, his energy core just ran out of juice. Like these guys, look, see, there that's fear. Yeah, that's fear. This guy, did he fall asleep? I don't know. Maybe he just gave up on existence at this point in time. Alright, so... No, that's just white stuff that way. How about down here? You know, I was going to tell you a story about how I got trolled by an octopus, but with the way this game's going to be, I'm never going to complete that story, so I'll tell you some other time, okay? Okay. Hey, face. What are you doing here? No, wait. I don't really care. If you didn't care, you wouldn't have asked. Did you see what happened to my friends? We came here to ask the Red Spirit for help. He doesn't talk to us, Red Folks, anymore, but I figured... We had to try, you know? You know, maybe the reason why he doesn't talk to you red folks anymore is because you're screwing everything up by being huge jerks. Just a theory. It doesn't matter now. I can't leave my guys like this. Then get out of my way and let me talk to the red dude. Go up to the shrine if you can make it. But if the red spirit helps you, just don't forget about us, okay? Oh, I'm totally going to forget about you just because I don't like you. You know, you should be really careful about the people that you aggravate, because the people that you aggravate may one day be the people who are essential to saving your way of life. And they just might forget that you exist and not save your way of life, but save everyone else's. Oh, okay. More jumpy bits. Mm hmm. So, why are we doing all this? Oh, okay, so it can't be on these for too long. I see. Mm hmm. Okay, so that was a dead end. I can go this way. Alright, is there any reason to- Ah, okay, I see why we go over here. For the brush. That'll work. Cool. There we go. That's another brush for the collection. I mean, I still have absolutely no idea why I'm collecting them, but it's another brush for the collection. Which is always... Oh, you gotta be kidding. Alright, hold on. Just let me get this. Alright, go again. And go. Yeah. I gotta do the same thing here. Can I get close? Ooh, that is probably grazing my face. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, so we need to go this way. Charge! Yeah, this way. And then up along the pipage. Nothing gonna fire down at me, right? Because I'm in a very vulnerable situation. Okay. Oh. Go. Yeah, so where, where to now? Should I just jump up there? Yep. Alright, cool. I'll just jump up there. Works for me. Oh, ooh, ooh. Oh. Okay. Stop being creepy, white stuff. Oh. Oh, this thing. Yeah. Catapults. That works. Alright, so the red dudes over there. Is there anything else over here? You know, like maybe they put a brush over here. Because this is kind of a gate type deal. No, yeah, it doesn't look like it. Alrighty. There you are! Sorry. I mean, there you are. I'm glad you followed my symbols, like I said. 
Very glad! Sorry, it always bursts out of me. Although I live in this relaxing temple. I'm currently opposite of well adjusted. Okay. Well, can you tell us what's going on? Or why you let us here? I can! Sorry. Well, first of all, the ble <laughs> I just I just looked at my little waveform. I am peaking so bad when I do that. Oh, the audio quality on this is gonna be so poor. I'm so I'm sorry, guys. At least I hope you get a laugh out of me just randomly shouting like this guy is. Sorry. Well, first of all, the bleakness is destroying the city. Yeah, I, I, I gathered. The bleakness? You mean that white stuff? Boy, you're smart. Sorry, but yes, it's the most destructive force in Tinker World. If we don't stop it, Color Town will be destroyed. Oh, so it's like that liquid, uh, li what is it, liquid paper? I don't know if it has another name. You know that stuff? It's like, I don't, if you, if, I don't know if you've ever used it. It's that stuff, it's, it's just like white stuff, and you use it to cover up like uh, pencil marks that won't erase. Yeah, I think it's called liquid paper. I don't know if it's got another name, but that's what I was always, you know, that's what people always refer to it when I was talking about it. Okay, so anyways, back to this. And how are we supposed to stop it? With a big mop? You really don't know your friend there with the fancy hair. He's a tinker. Huh? That's new. I guess you don't even know what that means, eh, Kuru? Explain it later. There's more important stuff to contend with right now. Look at the state of my dome. And look at my veranda. One of those bleak spawners has made itself comfortable there. You're a tinker. That makes you capable of wielding my power. You can use it to fight the bleakness. That's why I called you here. Sorry. Nah, screw it. Let's punch some color into his face. All right. Oh, he's, he's just gonna go inside me. <laughs> yeah, no, that's not weird or anything. Just having a very shouty red thing invade your chest. Well, I guess if it gives you like crazy superpowers, then it, it all works out. Jump down here, sure. Okay, what did that accomplish? Besides showing that gravity still exists. This way? No, that's just a balcony. Go this way. Yes. This way. This seems to be the way of progress. Oh, hey, hold on, hold on. I see you over there. I'm gonna get you. Yeah. Cool. Accomplishing this. Alright, so when do I get to. Ah, hey, 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 hey. Show them the power of strength by pressing B. So just punch the crap out of them. Just punch the crap out of him. Cool, yeah, that's... I Because I totally didn't have that power before. You know what? Whatever. Let's just go. The sooner we get done with punch sizing bleakness, the sooner this red thing can get out of my chest. Hey, guys! Come over here and get punched. I don't know. Maybe, like before, I couldn't destroy these things. But now I can. Because my I'm punching them with ink? I guess? But again, I could have accomplished that just by dipping my hands in wet paint before punching them. I mean, of course, I'd ha it means I'd have to run around with a bucket of wet paint in my hands. Or, you know, like, run around with a bucket of wet paint, ah, wet paint attached to me. But I mean, I've had more cumbersome things in my inventory and moved around just fine. Oh, no, no, no. Ooh. Yeah, it kind of sucks. I'm probably going to have to uh, make a save that's, like, perpetually at the... I don't know if I can. I might have to see if I can make a save that's perpetually at the tutorial level. Because I forget a lot of how to control this game between episodes. Because there's large castles. Ah! Oh! Why did I... Oh. I looked away when that happened. Totally was it bad reflexes. Oh, there we go. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Okay. Hey there! You kind of look like... You kind of look like that one thing from Dark Souls 2. I don't remember what it was called. Was it Sloth? Was it Sloth Demon? I don't know. If you've ever played Dark Souls 2, oh, okay, yeah. Okay, then punch size his core. Yeah, it so nice of you to uh, just jut your only weakness out for no reason whatsoever. But no, he reminds me of this one little monster. It was a boss from Dark Souls 2. 
It was a demon. I think I want to say it was like might have been glutton. Might have been glutton demon. It was either glutton demon or sloth demon. Either way, it looked kind of like that. And it's like primary way of attacking you is it would just roll over. And it was just kind of like, you know, roll over on top of you and crush you. But I think, if, if I remember right, it's been so long since I played Dark Souls 2, so you have to forgive me. But I believe if you just, like, slice the crap out of its tail, you'll pretty much get it in this situation. If you slice at it at the right angle, you get it in this situation where it keeps trying to roll on top of you, but it cannot. And you just kind of attack the crap out of it. Like that. Yeah! Useless facts aside, we've brought color back to the Red Temple. Which is good, I'm guessing. Now this is what a dome should look like. Amazing! All that color came out of that bean? Of course it did! Sorry, but yes. All that drain color has to go somewhere. When Kuru here defeated that creature, the color it was holding was set free. We saw a similar thing when the way to the market district was blocked. What? Why didn't you say so? But I was just... There's no time to lose. Take that jump pad. It should take us close to the exit. Boo! Alright. Oh, that one. Okay. And wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Is there anything here that... No, doesn't look like it. Um, it might. I might need to come back here upon a later date because something might have been opened up by the whole whiteness not being here anymore. So that might have revealed the way to other paintbrushes. Okay, that's a bridge. Why aren't you down? Who cares? I need to go this way and get to the exit to get back to. Oh, hey, can I? Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 Cool. That works. All right. Uh, don't. Don't go down this. I guess I gotta talk to you, don't I? Not bad, eh? Face. You just don't learn. You know, I should... Well, then again, I'm positive it wouldn't have let me get past him, and I need to get past him. It wouldn't have let me get past him until I punched them. A little beating didn't hurt them either. Now, before we can get out of here... You must deal with a bunch of those annoying shooters. They're the reason we got trapped in the first place. I say you pay them a visit and throw in a few punches while you're there. Okay. All right, so I gotta go after those guys. Clear up the stragglers, basically. I can do that if you, uh... That's what I thought. Okay, cool, he's gonna let me pass. All right, that works. All right, so just down this way. Oh, down here. Oh, ah, uh, okay, fine. Ow! Don't do that. Ah, wow. You guys are a lot tougher than your friends. There we go. Do it again! Because that really messes them up. Alright, this way? Yes. This way. Dodge roll, and then beat the crap out of him. Ah! Come on, hit him. There we go. Excellent. Oh, okay, so that just, just that. That works for me. Oh, okay, I see a little brush there. I don't know if you guys see it. In the lower left. Alright. I was gonna break these boxes anyways because I wanted the health. But hey, got a brush out of it too. That works. Alright, cool. Can I, can I just... Can I... Okay. Can I, there we go. I should not have been that hard. Alrighty. So follow Balzo, even though I really don't because I really don't like him. I'd much rather push him off a pier into water. Ah, hey! Oh, wait. No, I can't get to you. So never mind. I can't get to him, remember? He's us on the other side of the gate. All right, what do you got to say now? Useless. You really did it, Ape Face. I guess there's something I have to do now. Listen up. I'll only say this once. Thanks. I owe you one. Okay, guys. Let's bust out of here and head for the market district. Yeah, because they're so useful. Did that really just happen? Oh, uh, probably not. We should probably go ask him to repeat it just to make doubly sure. All right. So, ooh. Oh, my. Hi! So nice of you to just pop into existence. Hold on, I'll take care of these jokers right quick. Yeah, come on. And then dodge roll over to him. That way you get... No? No pun... Okay, no power punch. Never mind. I guess I'm not cool enough for power punches. All right, can't go in either of those directions. So, I'm guessing there's gonna be... Hey! 
stop doing the the being frozen thing. Okay. I don't know if I can get to him because I think the. <laughs> this is like some sort of torture for him. Just perpetually being unfrozen and frozen again. All right, I'm gonna leave him alone. That's just sadistic. All right, continuing on. So where is the? Oh, hi. All right, rip these guys up. Wow, you guys have a lot of HP. Like the other ones didn't have nearly that much. All right. Oh, hey, that thing. So I guess I need to punch a size that thing. Hold left trigger and press B to throw. Oh. All right, that works. Cool. I could just fling paint from my hands. All right, cool. That's a thing that I can do now. I I'm not gonna question it. All right, that's cool, that's cool. All right, so everything's hunky-dory, back to normal. Um, I don't know why we're going this way to get to the thing, considering it was back that way, but you know, it's whatever. You know, you don't need to be, get on Frozen. All right, so I guess I need to unfreeze all these people. Huh, weird, why don't they unfreeze then? When the color, that's weird. Eh, whatever, I ain't gonna question it. I'm getting money out of doing it, so just go ahead and punch everybody. There we go. Yeah, get paid to hit people again. I love this town. You get paid to punch things. Just like in San Andreas. All right, so, uh, can't go that way. Get this guy, yeah. All right, so, yep, can't go that way either. So let's go back to this guy that I was torturing. And this time, for realsies. There we go, cool. Alrighty, that's nice, that's nice. Um, okay, so that's everybody in this district by the looks of it, unless I missed somebody that was tucked away in a corner somewhere. So, we should be able to just go this way, right? Yes. Well, it's good to see everybody's all hunky-dory over here. Oh, ooh, yeah, you, no, I gotta destroy these. Yeah! Fox Apocalypse. Oh, hey, look, I even got a thing out of doing it. Hooray! Mindless destruction, having rewards. All right, so yeah, okay, everybody's fine. Lots of boxes. You having fun over there? You uh, you enjoying yourself? All right, whatever. Uh, you have fun doing that. I am going to end this episode because I am all out of time. Still, I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. Bye.